is so exciting. We are packing for Mexico! I'm so excited. I'm so excited, but I'm also very stressed because <laughs> packing for a family of five for a two week holiday, long haul, is, is a lot. It's a lot of pressure. Aloha. <laughs> Logan, are you excited for Mexico? Yeah! Are you ready to pack? Right, so I have a list. Mind you, you have several have, lists. We only have. Yeah, so, she loves a list, this one. She loves a list. So I've got a whole page for packing the main clothes. And then I've got a whole page of first aid, technology, toiletries. And then I've got a whole page of... Oh yeah, God, Mom. Hand, hand luggage. luggage. Taking kids on a nine-hour flight. You need to be organised. <laughs> so if you're new to our channel and you're watching this, you haven't seen us before, we're the Three Little Piggets and we are getting ready for Mexico. Hopefully you'll learn some tips on packing yeah. for a family yeah. of five. <laughs> Please subscribe. Subscribe! Right, let's start packing! And hit the like, like button, of course. To the loft. Let's go, let's go. I always ask if I can go to the lo into the loft and you're like, no, there's presents in there, and there's things so that you're not allowed to see in there. I really want there's to no presents in there for you today. <gasps> can I go up? No. <laughs> you see? I can't go up because my birthday's presents might be in there. No, we haven't bought you no presents. Do you know, last time we went into the loft, the cat, Leo, he, me and Dad, we were watching him. He went up the stairs, he climbed up and he was on this step. We had to get him down. Oh. But how many suitcases are we going to need? We're actually allowed to take one each. Do you think we're going to need a suitcase each? Well, oh, I, I want the wheelie hand luggage, the black one. I need one! Bigger than that, but let's take that, Libby. Can you reach up and grab it? Where is my one? You don't have one. Look, it's got my name on it. <laughs> That's Olivia Holly's one. Well, I love it so much, Chris. It has four wheels. Yes, yeah, mate. That's alright, Logie. We're gonna sort you out. You get a, your shark backpack for hand luggage, don't you? Oh. There's a big one. Ah! You want that for your hand luggage, Logan? No, no. I think it might be a bit too small for you. Right, so we've got one big yeah. suitcase. Guys, how many are we doing? Oof. I don't uh, know. I reckon let's start with three. And see if we need four. Start with three. I think start with two. No. We need three. No, no, because you're going to fit all the kids' things in one case. <laughs> Who is the worst at packing? Can I just say? Who is the worst? Who takes stuff Dad. and then brings it home again unworn? Me. Dad. You. Dad. That's the best. Dad. So I'm not Dad. sharing half a case with you who overpacks. Do you know what you're going to wear for your travelling to? Yeah, so actually I've just been sent to Davu tracksuits and I'll be wearing them. You're going to have the Davu tracksuit for travelling. So when we went to America, um, I wore flares and then I rang Holly. Guys! And then I. Yeah. Oh! The case! Have you got it, Holly? No. Yep. Yeah. But then I like. <gasps> so for the uh, plane, I rang like jogging shorts so then when we land in Mexico that I wouldn't be too hot. Yeah you can change. Yeah. So when we land in Mexico it's lunch time there so it will be hot. I am gonna get my hair cut to my shoulders for Mexico. Yeah. What other holiday prep have we got? Uh nails, brows, legs. Yes. Ooh. Logan what holiday prep have you got? Wow. This is a stressful job today. This is one I've been putting off. I'm putting off. You've been procrastinating off. enough today. I know it's like two o'clock in the afternoon now. Oh yeah. And I've been no, saying since is. ten we need yeah. to start packing. We'll start packing. Yeah. Right, Logie, off the off no, the stairs. No, you've been saying since yesterday. Let's start packing. I know. I've put it off tomorrow. long enough. It's not as bad as after your holiday unpacking and having to do all the washing. I know. That's so annoying. You don't know that feeling. Yes, I no, do. No, because. You're unpacking and your holiday is just finished. And, and you feel all sad that life is back to normal. One of the travel hacks that I've learned over the years and I stick by is making sure that your clothes are packed over several suitcases because if the airline loses a bag or it gets damaged or wet or whatever, then that person's entire load of clothes is not lost or ruined. What I think we should, should do is get the things that we're gonna take on holiday and pay, make a pile each in the front room. You know what I don't understand is why we took the suitcases downstairs when we need stuff upstairs. Because there's more space on the floor down here. And also, yeah. um, do you know how many days until Mexico? Don't know. 15. 
I feel like I should have done this job while they were at school. I'm, I'm starting to regret my decision to include the children in this. Right, what? what I need you to do. Sorry, could you regret your decision to include me in? No. So we need to get our piles of clothes and find a space. Like Christmas morning when you have a space of Christmas presents, yep. you need a space of your clothes so I can go through them. I'm in this corner here. Okay. I'm here. So go upstairs and get the things that you want to take. You need denim jacket, you need swimwear, you need pyjamas, you need shorts. Take the list with you. Bye. Now I'm stressed. Yeah. I'm actually not doing this alone without you. I'm actually <laughs> not. So I've just got like lots. I've got a few bikinis. All these colours are so nice. Look. Yeah. They're really cheap as well. That's a nice little dress, isn't it? Bring this one to Mexico. Yeah, why not? Did it fit you? Olivia, whilst that drawer is open, can you grab maybe three pairs of pajamas? Olivia, those Minnie Mouse ones are age seven. They're not going to fit you, darling. Yeah, they will. Can you please get your dresses and your denim jacket? Denim jacket. Are they all your shorts up there? Yep. Okay, ready? Three, two, one. Oh no! Um, I need jumper. jumper. I need jumper? Two? Jumper? Yeah. In the evenings it can be a bit chilly. Should I bring like a little one? Yeah. This is rather confuzzling me. T-shirts. This is probably the the hardest way to uh, pack. It's just getting the kids to run these? riot. I'm just going to wait for Olivia to finish then. Yeah. Because it's really crazy. So, one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, <gasps> thirteen. The Mickey Mouse is <gasps> definitely needed. Fourteen. Yay. Right, Holly, get the list. Get the list. Okay, so I already have swimwear and pyjamas. Is that all your swimwear? Yeah. Is that all your cover-ups and everything? Only a full cover-up. Denim jacket. Oh. Oh. <laughs> That's a no. That's a hard parse. I've actually had this for like three years. Though. Okay, that's not coming with you. So we got more of those dresses, didn't we? The last update we had was ordering these things. Yeah, I'm just... These are just the ones that are on one massive hanger. Can you go and get all Logan's shorts, all Logan's t-shirts and all Logan's swimwear? In our bedroom is more of Logan's swimwear and all their water shoes. For the excursion days. So you want me to empty his wardrobe of all of his stuff basically? Hats. One. Hats. Let's find hats. Oh my clip in there. Hold on, there's a hat back here. Hat for Loki. Oh my god! Why have you tipped it out? Okay, so I'm going to go. Oh. Right, I've got three hats, is that enough? Three hats is enough. I'll have it. Right, let, what's those other baseball caps there, Holly? Let me see them. Uh, Daddies. One, North Face. They're all dads. Another North Face and then a Minecraft one. Oh, do you want the Minecraft one, Logan? Um, I'll have the Minecraft one and the Peach one. <laughs> okay, this is pure carnage. If you're watching this video yeah. for tips on how to pack, this is probably, like, not the way tips to on pack. Tips on how not to pack. <laughs> okay, <laughs> no, put no, those no, down. But I did just look at the weather in Tulum and it looks good. Oh, I was really frightened about what you were going to say then. Do you want to yeah, see? Yes, yes, wanna yes, see? yes. Okay, cool. We want to see. I thought it would literally be really cold. I thought you would say it's really cold. So just this is like, this is a 10 day forecast. So we're <coughs> oh going to- Oh my God. Ah, 31 going... degrees. Woo! Oh, it's in the house. It's got to be hot. Okay. Guys, look at the carnage of my living room now. Look, this one is Holly's pile. It's hot in the house. It's hot in the house. Okay, Olivia's thing. She's got all her shoes, her shorts, jumpers, coats, da 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 da. And then Logan's pile over here. These things, right? I know that they're ugly. Holly was like, absolutely not. They're super ugly. However, when you see if there's a jellyfish and you're walking about in these or you're going to the excursion and you're climbing over all the rocks you are going to thank me for them I've changed my mind I hate packing I don't want to do it Packing is the worst oh. On a holiday, uh. what is the worst thing? Packing. Okay, guys 
do you want me to just speed this up now so that you guys get to see it like not in real time? Should I just fast forward this <gasps> bit? <laughs> Done! Please can you put one shorts, one t-shirt, one swimwear into your hand luggage? Only one, only one of each. One thing, yep. Yeah. That's all my shorts and t-shirts. So, each of these can be, be my hand luggage. Do you need a hand luggage? Yes. Do you need one with four wheels, not just two wheels? If I could magic one down the stairs now, Logan, if I could magic you a little suitcase that's just for you with four wheels, would you be really happy? I know that daddy's coming. Oh! It's Woo! Dinosaur! You've got yeah, your yeah. own hand luggage! I do not even know that. Boom, you have got your own hand luggage. We bought it for Bye -bye. your birthday, Logan. We yes. bought it as a birthday present, so you got an early birthday present and a packing present. Nice, Yay! huh? Packing is not the works anymore, is it? Packing's all the time got a bit better. Look, Logan, you got a zip for your iPhone, pockets for your snacks and your technology, <laughs> and then all your clothes can go in here. Colouring books, anyway, colouring pens. If, if you need something to carry with your phones, you can definitely put it in my bag. I wouldn't do this really for the girls because they can pair up their things, but for Logan, I've tried to like get a complete outfit. Looks good so far. Wrap the shorts inside. Good tactic. When he gets to the other side, he can just unfold them and put them all in his wardrobe, and it's easy for him to get himself dressed in the morning. Do you want to take your white fox sliders up to Dad because he's cleaning his Crocs? Do you want to go and take your things up and get Daddy to clean your sliders for you? So my white fox sliders. I'm also going to bring my Crocs. Because they got a bit dirty today. Right. We are traveling up the stairs. I can't feel it. I can't it. Mm -hmm. okay, on, you have to clean my coat and my white fox slides. Here yeah. comes Logan with his stuff. Put them in the bath. White oh. Fox look amazing. Yeah, amazing pretty now. clean if I must say so myself. Go on and bang them in. Chuck them in. Bosh. Right. They will Bosh. be cleaned and we'll be back. We are just. Making outfits for me now. <laughs> Hooray! Well, I, I so just exciting. I would normally pack like this. I would normally just pack a stack of shorts, stack of t-shirts. But Olivia has liked how we've done it with Logan yeah. and made outfits ready. Yeah. So that's what we're doing. So we've got some. We've got some already. So we've got this one. Mm -hmm. But I just want it to be like more really colourful for Mexico. And then we've got this one. And this one which we brought and they're all sets i'm gonna show you guys dad's progress wow nice clean one look nice and clean and then skanky mm -hmm. how about this one and this one maybe oh your mickey mouse one might look cute with that you have so many pairs of shorts yeah you're done bosh now to start rolling we have saved the debut packing bags or mucky <laughs> shoes. Because I don't want to put those on top of anyone's clean. Hey mum, listening to you, um, saying like, I don't want to put any dirty shoes on people's cl um, clean clothes. It just makes you sound so organised. Yeah, <laughs> I am organised. Ugly swim shoes. <laughs> They're going to thank me for them, I'm telling you. Ryan's done a good job. If you saw our last travel video, he was cleaning shoes on the morning of our flight. So this is, a, this is progress, Ryan. You're doing it in advance. Progress, we've got a little bit of progress, guys. Right, Holly, are you ready? It's your turn. These guys have given up already. Are you bored? Yes. Are you bored? It's even more boring, boring than it's even more boring than t putting Christmas decorations up. <laughs> Hello guys, I'm gonna show you guys what I've packed, like makeup and skincare wise. There's a lot. Okay, so I've got an eyebrow gel. I've got mascara, a waterproof one. I have lip gloss, contour and blush. Uh, and then for makeup, um, skincare even, I have the SPF moisturiser thing. I have an SPF glow. I have just a regular moisturiser. 
have a serum. I have a toner. Mom. I have some tanning drops. Mommy. And then I have a face um, wash. My little mini jewelry box that my friend bought for me for my birthday. What? I've gone with a gold thing, even though I've already put gold in my ears, but I've only got them for my first. And I will only wear them during the day and take them out. We're actually packing really early because in between now and our holiday is Logan's birthday and we're celebrating all weekend. So this was my only clear weekend where I could really make sure I've got everything. And if I've forgotten anything, make sure I've got enough time to go out and buy it, which I have. Short sleeve pyjamas, they don't have enough of. So I will need to go and buy those tomorrow. We've got one, two, three suitcases. These are actually only half full. So mine and Ryan's stuff will fit into those and with that one. Uh, hand luggage we're gonna do day before we fly. Cause that's last minute. They've got, a, they've got pajamas in there. They've got a spare change of clothes in there. And they've got swimming costume in there. So they've got those things, but everything else like entertainment technology, headphones, coloring, puzzles, all that kind of stuff. Um, yeah, we'll pack that nearer the time. Now we're gonna weigh these suitcases. That looks chunky. We've had to unzip this little bit. Right. So we got <laughs> because of the wheels. It weighs nothing. Don't worry. Right, you get on there and then add it with you on it as well. Okay, cool. It's Twenty-two. That's close, isn't it? Hang on. That's what we want. What is the max? Twenty-three. Black case. Black case. I've got my dresses hanging up. They haven't got in the case. I can't remember where I left you guys when the last time I was vlogging about packing. Um, we did go and get four suitcases. We went and got the fourth one, which at the moment is completely empty. Um, but we are going to need it. So me and Ryan went shopping and bought some new trainers because, you know, need new trainers for holiday. So we both went and bought some new trainers. They're gonna go in there. And then I basically went and got the kids a load of um, short sleeve pajamas. So I've got Olivia a, hold on, stitch nighty, some stitch pajamas. These are all from Primark at the moment. They're really cute. These are like a little cropped pajama top. I hadn't seen those before. When she tried them on, it looked really cute. She really liked them. Um, just made sure I've got Logan some short sleeves. Hold on, let me show you some short sleeve pajamas. Um, it is now one week till our holiday. Exactly, exactly one week. Um, you don't see that, but basically when I got like tons of um, underwear from Primark, really cheap, basically just so that they've got a fresh pair of underwear every single day of the holiday and we don't have to worry about doing any washing while we're away. I've also, got my pharmacy bag so i spent 70 pounds 70 pounds on um pharmacy stuff so i don't know if it's worth me showing you guys do you shall i show you right let me show you let me just get this out hold on it's moments like this where i'm so grateful for this den basically we can just shove everything down here so um yeah if you're watching this video and new to our channel basically getting advice for packing or traveling with um kids long haul um, I didn't realise, I know that Holly gets travel sick, Logan sometimes feels a bit sick in the car, but when we flew to Florida, he was really sick when we were landing. Um, so I've got some travel sickness tablets. Uh, now that Logan is six, I've basically got the six plus uh, cowpaw sachets so that they can just go in the beach bag in case, you know, they get a fever or anything. And then I've got things for mozzies. So I've got the jungle formula, the afterbite pen and kids puritan so if they get bitten um prickly heat insect bites allergies itchy rash like anything skin allergies anything like that they they basically got puritan for the last time we went to mexico we did get a bit of an upset tummy uh, and people that i know have traveled to mexico have had the same thing i don't think it's just a mexico thing i think it's just traveling abroad isn't it and, and you know different foods different waters and all that kind of stuff so i just made sure because i was caught out on our honeymoon i just made sure i got kids diarrhea medicine adult diarrhea medicine and then diarrhea to replenish any salts and stuff if we do have sickness or diarrhea while we're there hopefully that's just a precaution we're not going to need any of this stuff 
I haven't done the shopping for our toiletries yet. I do need to do that. Um, but so far, I have bought... <laughs> oh, I've got another bug repellent. Um, some after sun. And then this company, Child's Farm, I absolutely love them. I haven't tried their sun cream before, but it's a uh, Factor 50 SPF. Holly, basically, if she has a Factor 50 on... She gets prickly heat and she gets a heat rash and is and is so uncomfortable, so itchy and um, her skin really reacts. So she actually has to have a lower SPF and just apply more regularly. And then I've just got this one because it just smells so delicious, this one. So I've got some sun cream. I'm going to need more because two weeks in the sun with three kids, we go through so much sun cream. But I think this might just be the most organised I have ever been I think that's pretty much everything that I can think of to tell you guys and show you guys. So, yeah, thank you so much for watching. We'll see you when we're on the aeroplane to Mexico. <laughs>